Praxis Prepper. Hey everybody, this is Praxis and I've got good news for you. That bug out card game that I designed that I've been talking about for the past month or so, it's happening. We've reached our funding goal to, due to the help from many, many people, but in particular Ryan from Prescott Caliber Club really helped to bring us over the line on that. And uh, now it's, it's going to be happening. Uh, all we're waiting for at the moment is just for the fundraising period to finish. Uh, people are putting in you know their last orders. If you would like to get one of these bug out card games, it's a... Well, uh, if you're not familiar with what I'm talking about, there's a, I'll have a video at the end to explain it to you. But it's uh, you know it's a prepping preparedness card game for helping to teach prepping and preparedness to young people or people that aren't into it. You know, it's again like most of what I do on my channel. I hope all of what I do on my channel, trying to make it fun, engaging, and get more people engaged uh, in the idea of general preparedness. So it's happening. If you'd like to get a, a game deck, uh, you can go over to. Which one is it? It's okay. Here's a link at the bottom. It's like Kickstarter slash something, something, something. Uh, you can put it in an order and you can be part of the first wave of people that will get your cards, uh, you know, when the whole thing happens. Right now, I'm just working on getting everything uh, print and press ready, getting all the files together, making sure they're all like set and everything. So that way, as soon as the fundraising period ends on August 31st, everything will be ready to go and the presses can start spinning and then we'll get everything back and sent out to you guys. Uh, so if you're interested in the card game, uh, you still have a couple of weeks to, to get in and get in order so you can be par part of the wave of the first, you know, people that are, um, you know, going to be receiving the cards. But even after that, it's, um, yeah, I, I don't, I don't want to create like this sense of like fear or urgency. <laughs> It's like you'll be able to get one even if you you know do it an order after the fact except i'm not going to be um hosting any of those orders uh after the fact uh after the fundraising finishes uh you'll be able to get them actually from the prescott caliber club website so uh they'll be starting to take orders over there so uh but if you want to be part of the first group to do it kickstarter link down below you can go there put in your order and you'll be part of the first group to get uh you know decks or cards out that's it i'm very excited about it and here is the video explaining what I've been talking about if you weren't familiar with what I'm talking about. That's it. Thanks for watching. Hey everybody, this is Praxis. One of the primary driving missions of my preparedness channel has always been to try to help people by sharing knowledge and experience. I feel this way about people at large that I don't even know that I've never met, but even more so for my family, where I'm always trying to help keep them safe to protect them, and beyond that, to try to teach them to protect themselves. As a dad, I'm always looking for opportunities to share my knowledge about preparedness with my boy, and I do that in a number of ways. You know, as simple as just when a topic comes up, discussing it with him, we'll go hiking, we'll go camping. When it comes to preparedness, I always try to explain to my boy what I'm doing and why I'm doing it. But whatever the approach is to sharing these lessons, I've always found that they work better and he pays attention more if it's fun and it's engaging. I try to do that with my YouTube channel as well. I try to keep things funny and I try to keep them light. What are the kids today calling it up? Uh, splitting the wood. No one calls it that the wood, anymore, I Dad. I did that with the Alien Invasion series with the science fiction element and trying to keep it interesting and dramatic. That's not a good sound. I'm just going to move out it. Okay, we'll do this later. Flipping that off. Holy shit. And now I'm doing it again with a new card game that I'm calling Bug Out. Bug Out is a fun way to share ideas related to emergency preparedness and wilderness survival skills with your family and especially with the kids in your life. The entire structure of the gameplay fosters values such as preparing for hazards, saving up for the future, balancing potential risks, and striving past obstacles. And in addition to this, almost every card in the deck has its own unique preparedness or survival tip related to what's going on in the game. I also designed the game to be super easy to learn and anyone can play it without having to learn a huge pile of intricate rules, and I took a lot of time with the artwork to make the cards look great and grab kids' attention. Essentially, play breaks down into the mindset that there's been an emergency situation, there are problems, and there are solutions, and your goal is to manage both of those things while you're pushing forward towards success. That's a lesson that's useful in an emergency situation, but also just in normal day-to-day -day life. If a game like this sounds like something that you might be interested in giving to your kid, grandkid, or anyone in your life that you think would benefit from a little extra prepper mindset, then here's how you can help to make this into a reality and be able to share that gift with whomever you had in mind. The good news is 
the card game, the packaging, everything is all set and ready to go. My goal has always been to have it ready for the holiday season this year. So if you have people in your life that you think would benefit from these sorts of survival and preparedness messages, you'd have an opportunity to share this game with them. The only thing missing, as a matter of fact, is just the funding to bring it to the printer, get it all printed up, and send a deck out to you. If you'd like to partner with me to create this family game experience and get a copy or two for your own family as well, please consider making a pledge towards the goal needed to get this project printed. I have rewards set at many different levels, including the chance to appear on one of the cards if you're so inclined. And that's it. The links are below. Thanks for watching. This episode has been brought to you in part by Prescott Caliber Club and Jeske Defense Strategies. Prescott Caliber Club is a federally licensed firearm manufacturer and retail store specializing in firearms, survival gear, and producing great online content. If you want to thank them for supporting this channel, go check them out at prescottcalclub.com. Please subscribe and tune in every Friday at 4.30 New York time for a new video. And if you'd like to support this channel, you can do so both through Patreon or PayPal.